speaking to the world's leaders. Dunedin man Tuwari Potiki has just been people. addressing the General Assembly of the United Nations in New York. The Director of Māori Development at the University of Otago was speaking in his role as Chairman of the New Zealand Drug Foundation. It's huge, you know, the room is huge. It's all of those countries, 100 and something countries all represented at, at a really high level. Um, so yeah, it was a little bit daunting, but amazing. It was a fantastic experience, ultimately. It felt a lot better after I'd finished, of course. Portiki spoke we about the war on drugs on during the last day of a three-day uh, special session. He says he was irritated with how some countries were behaving, so his speech ended up more blunt than political. So you know, there were countries, like I said in the speech, like Russia, um, China, Iran, um, Indonesia, mostly countries who still have the death, death penalty for drug offences. Um, and they were just trying to block everything. Every, any time anybody stood up and talked about progress, about using health approaches to try and help people with drug problems, they jump up and say no, no, no. Now he's calling for a change to Aotearoa's 40-year-old drug policy, so widespread issues can be addressed throughout the country. He wants to see a health-based approach to tackling problems, away from the criminal justice system. Portiki says the UN experience is one he'll never forget, and it's armed him for the fight to reform drug laws on home turf. Daryl Beza, 39, Dunedin News.